Hi guys, it's Crystal with Crafty Mob 2 and Desert Addiction Tumblers. Today I'm going to show you why I use, why and how to use Quick Coat from Counterculture DIY. It's a urethane sealer. So whenever I'm applying water slides or vinyl to my tumbler, um, once it's on, especially water slide, you want to let it dry and set. And before you put your epoxy on, you're going to want to use this. Uh, you're going to want to use this quick coat um, just uh, to apply lightly onto your tumbler over the water slide or vinyl. Um, it helps seal it. Have you ever had where your, especially water slides, and vinyl when you put the epoxy on you come back and check and you've noticed in certain spots your um, decal has started to lift and there's nothing you can do about it until your epoxy dries then you're stuck with having to sand it um, and smooth it out hopefully um, or in some cases you may have to strip the whole cup I've actually had that happen to me in the past before I started using the quick quote, quick coat. Um, and I'm going to show you here on one of my tumblers. You can see where the water slide lifted after um, I applied my epoxy. You see there, and now I would just have to either seal it, or no, I'm sorry, sand it down, or with this, the way it, where it's at, I'm actually gonna probably have to just strip it or get a little crafty and either apply another water slide. But honestly, there is a few spots where it lifted on me. So I'm probably just gonna strip the whole cup and save that one for another day. Um, so I'm going to show you how to apply it super easy. I usually do it about 15 minutes before I do my epoxy. And honestly, this has been such a game changer for my tumblers and not having to worry about those, um, vinyl decals or water slides coming up, especially when you use, um, like that holographic vinyl for some reason. I had so many issues with that starting to come up in little spots and then I have this weird wave. It was just horrible. So let's continue. I'll show you guys how to get it done. All right guys, so here is the quick coat that I use from Counterculture. I buy the tips from them also that just screws right on the bottle. It makes it nice and easy to apply. I also use these finger condoms that I get from off of Amazon. It's they're very cheap. It's a lot easier than wasting a whole glove since gloves are hard to get right now. And so I just go through and I do small drops of the urethane along my tumbler on my decal and just spread a thin coat across my decal. You just want to do a little bit at a time. You don't want to overdo it or else you'll get kind of like a big clump. Um, and it just makes it, takes longer to dry, and you just don't need that much. And that's pretty much it, guys. You're just going to go around your decal, like I said, and just go over smoothly. You're going to do that and let it dry for about 15 to 20 minutes until it's dry to the touch. And then you can move on to the next step, which is doing your epoxy. Um, like I said, this was a big game changer for... Um, applying the decals and vinyl I didn't get that lit I don't get that lift like I used to so you'll have to let me know what you guys think and if you liked our tutorial be sure that you're following us and give us a like and um, this will also be on my YouTube channel so if you're watching on YouTube make sure you subscribe to my crafty mob too thanks again guys mm -hmm.